Hello everyone, welcome back to another video today. Uh, I'm going to be showing you two methods, one for Windows operating systems and one for Chrome operating systems like Chromebooks. Uh, I don't know what the others are, I think it's like Chrome pads or something weird. But um, since spam open boxes got patched, you guys are probably itching for good ways to open boxes fast, and that's where I am coming into play. So, there's something called OP Auto Clicker 3.0, which is one of the like base things that you're gonna need for the Windows, um, for the window, uh, Windows version of this opening boxes faster. Of course, I searched that OP Auto Clicker 3.0. Now we have OP Auto Clicker right here. And just hit download. It'll bring you to SourceForge. Uh, I'm just gonna click off because I've already downloaded it and I don't want to download it again because that'll cause a mess on my computer. But basically, download that. Link will be in the description. And after you follow the setup tutorial for all of that, it'll open up this. And it should start off with the basic, I think it's 100 milliseconds. And you can go and change that to 10 or 1, whatever you'd like. Make sure the mouse button is set to left, and single or double doesn't really matter, that's completely up to you. And for hotkeys, this is how I got mine to control R. Hit start, then hit control R, or anything else that would make you feel more comfortable doing the auto clicker command. So now, zoom in all the way if you're on Windows, and scroll down space box and just hit control R and watch the magic happen bam that's the quickest way for Windows because spam open boxes does not work um, and now onto the Chrome version let me open a different browser because for some reason my bookmarklet for the auto clicker will not work so there are some Chromebooks with uh, that only touchscreen Chromebooks. You can get, um, I'm not sure what they're, I think it's an app on the Google Play Store. Um, but yeah, you can sign in to your Google Play Store and there has to be an app or something. I think it's like a automatic touch click thing. I'll have a link in the description for you, don't worry. So, for this new method, there's a bookmarklet, which you probably know what bookmarklets are if you've seen my earlier hacking videos. Um, there's a code right here, and this is an auto clicker bookmarklet. And as you can see, we'll go through it, see if there's anything related to, um, tech, wait, uh, notepad. So just search up notepad, I'm pretty sure there is probably, like, here we go. So, let me post something. Here's it. There's nothing that could even be a token logger or anything harmful in here. It was made by G Basil and Glizzy. Or, uh, not G Basil, by uh, Basil and Glizzy. It was posted on their website before they had the time of time, time. I don't even know. I think it's time update. There's nothing to do with tokens in here. Control F. Uh, oh my god, I can't type. Token. Find nothing with the specified string. There's nothing with the token logger, so you're completely safe. Now, what you're gonna do, uh, there's actually a second part to this that you're gonna need to get. So go over to your Chrome Web Store, and there is an extension called CTG Plugins. Oh my gosh, can't type. This new keyboard is killing me. So, CTG plugins. They, it's completely safe. There's nothing harmful. Let's see recent. Really good for quick, 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 No harmful. Nothing in it. Let's try to use the auto clicker and it didn't work. Just click on something that isn't in your browser. Okay. It will not work on games that are not in your browser or anything like that. But let me see if we can get the auto clicker to work again. This might, I might be able to get it to work. If it works, 
on, um, oh god, I am a mess on this new code. Let's just name it, oh, whatever, it doesn't really matter. So, click the, oh, yes, it works now. So, this is what will happen. You'll get an arrow like this on your computer. This is completely normal. If you go up here, you'll have a regular thing back. Now, place it on the space box. It'll make this pop up every time automatically. You can't really beat it. And now, with the CTG plugins, hit select, click target, place it on yes. This will automatically open it up. You will have to click the box though. That's the only downside. But yeah, it's really cool. It helps a lot with opening boxes fast. And select, and bam. So yeah, uh, if anything doesn't work or you need any clearer tutorial, please let me know. I'll be open to helping you. And if there's an easier way to this, and I'm just I don't really know any other ways except for auto cooking, um, I'm pretty sure this works on Android phones. I'm not sure if it works on iOS phones. I doubt I doubt it does because uh, it just doesn't feel like it would work. Um, but yeah, also. Let me plug something real quick. Wait, wait. Open C. My Open C account, guys. Yes, I I use Open C for NFTs, which is pretty cool, I guess. Um, yeah. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I hope this will help you with opening look at boxes quicker. Um, but yeah, have a nice day and. Uh, not really sure what else to say. Just have a nice day. Um, I think I might stream tomorrow. I got Forza Horizon, so I'm really excited to stream that. Um, so yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I hope you have an amazing rest of your day. Uh, peace out.